you had a good break. I know I sure did. Uh, we are going to... <clears throat> we're going to roll our next ship here in a second. And uh, do another run. So let me update the stats here. That is actually our 60th run that we have tracked since uh, since the start of December when I started streaming. We, we just went up a tenth of a percentage point in win rate. So we are now at 96.7 win rate. Let's fucking go. And that is 48 ships in a row. And uh, what ship was that? Uh, Fede. Fede, yeah. That was our first, first Fed ship that we've done in this cycle. Feels good to get one of those out of the way. Fed ships can be very sketchy and bad. Did I take a fruit? Oh yes, I have a fruit. I have an apple. A good apple. Okay. Let's just uh, get right into it then. Apple sounds crisp as fuck. It's pretty crispy, yeah. Okay, so, I think it's a, I don't, is it a Fuji? It might be a Fuji. I'm not sure. Okay. So here's our streak. We've done Zoltan A and B, Lanius, both of the Lanius, both of the Crystals, all of the Stealth, all of the Slug. Uh, we have NG A and C. We've done Mantis B. Kestrel A and C, Rock A and B, and Fed A. So, we have eight ships remaining. Or is it nine? Oops. No, I think it's eight. Yeah, eight. No. Hold on. Yeah, so, um... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, eight. Okay, wow. All right, yeah, a lot of tricky ones left. We're running out of good ones left, so here we go. Random, we have done Mantis B. We have not done Fed B. This this one is pretty weak. Maybe one of the best, uh, maybe the best, um, maybe the best Fed ship, but it's pretty weak still. The weapons on Fed B are, are very weak early, and they, um, you know, I don't know, you, you, you just have, you have issues with, uh, with, with, you know, with, um, enemies running away is, is kind of a weakness to the ship, so. We will be eating an apple. I apologize in advance, everyone. They look the same as a Kestrel. They're like shittier version of the Kestrel. But yeah, it's like a missile. It's like, the Kestrel has the Artemis, which is the best missile weapon in the game, but only like two ships have it. And then... This is also a really good weapon. The dual lasers, which do two shots for one power. But it's two shots. So, the Lido, and the Lido does one damage. It charges slightly faster, though. We also have a shit ton of reactor power, so, yeah. Okay. But yeah, we want to get two shields and an offensive upgrade. And again, we have, like, the forced artillery, but... This artillery has, it, it, you start with uh, level two artillery, so that's something at least. All right, let's fight the ship. This guy's pretty dangerous, but I think we'll be okay. Get the basic laser off, sadly. Uh, I won't worry about upgrading. Or, oh, nice! That's a mantis, actually. That's really good. I'll shoot this guy. Nice. Oh, there's a fire. They're gonna put that out in a GIF. Keep him here. Oh, nice. Okay, mantis repairing this. Okay, and then the, 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 the beam should come in here. I think I want to leave off the, um, the artillery, though. So 
so we can just shoot these more and get like training for the whole town. Nice. Okay, he's repairing this. Oh, okay, we started a fire again. Let me go up here, just to see what's going on. Oh, this guy's kind of low. This guy's not, though, so. Good Trico. Good old Trico. Double fire, wow. I don't think he's going to be able to put it. Uh, he's going to be able to put it out anyway, so whatever. Alright, we're dead. Yeah, unless they resist the map. Yeah. Okay. Team Scrap, nice. Okay. We also don't have anything to sell on this ship early, which sucks. I hate that, I hate that about a ship. Ooh, Pulsar, what could this be? Oh my god. Oh Jesus, this is so bad. Okay. This is slot one, this could be an Artemis. What level hacking is this? Is that a fucking Artemis? Okay, thank god it is not an Artemis. Holy shit, this is so scary. It's level one hacking. Level one hacking. Okay, this fires before the pulsar. Where does it hit me? Doors we missed. Probably. Maybe I wait until the uh, the ion. Yeah, nice, nice, huge. Yeah, I gotta save my Lido. I, I want to shoot shields. Is that a repair drone? I think it's a repair drone. And we fucking double miss? You've got to be shitting me. Dude. You actually got to be shitting me. Nice. Oh. I forgot about the basic laser. Okay, come on, Artie. Do what you were born to do. Let's go. Okay, already actually kind of came in clutch there. Okay, wow. That could have gone so much worse. That was really, really scary. We actually can't upgrade, um... <laughs> we can't upgrade our... our <laughs> we can't get the shield buffer. Because of the, uh, the pulsar, unfortunately. This gives us a map. So yes, I will take this. Shield hack is annoying. What level is it? Is that level two? Are you fucking kidding me? Nice. Thank God for that. Level two shield hack, man. That's so annoying. Sure, double miss. Seems legit. Okay, level one piloting, thank god. Nice. Good job, Artie. You did good. Okay, there's our map. That is beautiful. It's a double store. But honestly, unless, like, we get, hmm, well, one, two, three, four, five, six, this could be a really lucrative sector. You really want the shield buffer? We're gonna go here, here, here. Maybe distress. We don't have amazing distress, except, yeah. No, we do have a slug blue option. I don't think we have a Zoltan blue option. We have a beam blue option for the artillery. Maybe a missile blue option, I'm not sure. Let's fight the ship. Missile and a B, uh, burst laser one. Oh, 
Hello. Oh, lovely. Mm. Thank you, shield buffer. Mm. Nice. Okay, piloting is on fire there. Mm. Love the ship. God, this the starting level on the ship are so ass, dude. It's literally so bad. Come on, Slug, you can do it. Can you not do it? Oh, you could do it, Slug. Nice, good job, Artie. Good job, Artie. I knew you had it in you. Uh, okay, that's save game manager bug. Weirdness. Give me your power. There you go. Good. Nice. Okay, we have uh, we have two shields. That is very good. Sure. I have a Zoltan. Whoa, the Zoltan blue option. I could get oxygen level two here. Let's go. Okay, yeah. Unique talent for life support systems. You're trying to get my beans. Yeah. <laughs> I'll never surrender the beans. I'm sorry if I just ate into the microphone, by the way. This is a really good apple. That was fuego. Get to the storage cache. Oh, this fight is saved. Hell yeah. They cannot damage us. Hablas Espanol, spicy lad. Hablas Espanol un paquito. Cool. Muy guay. Yo también. Lo hablo un, un poco. Pero muy, muy mal. <laughs> sí. Quieres instrucciones para tu gramática? I don't know if that was right, but all right, we're back. I'm just gonna speed this up because this shit is so slow. Nice. My span mi español está más más uh, más 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 bien. I don't know. It's better. Thank you. <laughs> That's really good, actually. That's really good. Más bien. Yeah, I think so. One, two, three. Yeah, let's do that. We're probably gonna have to miss the top store. Doc can try to rescue. Eight for four damage. That's not terrible, but that's kind of bad. I don't know. The scrap is. Sure, let's go to the station. Another safe fight. Nice. Which I will speed up. Nice. Nice! Yes, that's awesome. 
I made a drone, dude. Okay. Safe fight again? Hell yeah. I'm just gonna speed hack this shit then. Oh, I don't know what that says. I'm sorry. <laughs> Oh, nice fire. Nice. Needy scrap, hell yeah. Me hablo, so I assume you mean hablo. Oh yeah, it, it would also be yo hablo. Me is like my, it's like possessive. Like me, me zapatos. My shoes, you know. Do I want to go to the asteroid field? Probably. So I can get to the store. Pirate rigger. Very scary. But the asteroids break their shields and we can shoot their weapons. Ouch, that's unfortunate. It's okay, a human can help put out the, the, the fire. Good job, human. Oh, nice. Thank you, Asteroid. Yeah, Asteroid, hell yeah. Comrade Asteroid, over here. No running, sorry. Peace out. Yach. 16, yes. Very good. Very, very good. Oh! That's so good. Fuck. That's so fucking good. Yes. Oh my god, yes. Give me that fucking flak. Holy shit. Do I get the flak and the halberd? Fuck, that's crazy. Yes, that's so good. I mean, straight up, I can do this. I could sell the Lido, get the get the halberd, and then have a game-winning setup once I find, you know, hacking and cloaking. But getting the halberd feels maybe a little greedy. If I, uh, you know, because it, it it would potentially put me out of uh, range of getting the uh, getting <clears throat> hacking if I see it early in the next sector. I do want repairs. I also want the backup battery. They drew up conjugations into you. I forgot all the like past tense, like the perfect, perfect tense and the preterite or whatever. I don't know. Well, no, I remember the preterite pretty well. Uh, I'll keep the Lido for now. French conjugations fuck you up, yeah. Sadly, sadly punished. Very sadly punished. But it was worth. Rebel or Pirate 2? Um, I guess probably Pirate. These both are a little bit lame, but Pirate's a little less scary, I think. Let's go Pirate. their offer. Pastons can go suck a lemon. It's a good it's a good way of putting it. I don't know, yeah, I don't really know like subjunctive or future or anything like that. Ouch. Good hits, good hits. Please don't run. Speed hacking? I don't know. I'm okay. German 
and compound orders are crazy, yeah. Okay, we are within range of doing hacking here, but I'm gonna take one more jump. Okay. Slightly punished for taking the extra jump, but it's okay. Nice. I don't think they're repairing weapons. This honestly could theoretically be a crypto here. Okay. okay, it's level two. Nice. Zwei thousand Virund Zwanzig. Zwei thousand. Thousands, really thousands. It's crazy. Oh, double store right now. Okay, that's good. I guess I have to take it. Just cloaking. Can't afford it. Alright. Nothing I wanted there. There's hacking. Let's fucking go. Another flak. Whoa. I mean, I, I gotta just get hacking, but the other flak is beautiful to see. Cool. Alright. Man, okay. Um, oh, oops. Sector is not updated. Hmm, I don't know if I'll keep doing the sector thing, honestly. I keep forgetting to update it, so I don't know if it's like. I don't know if it's worth it. Because <laughs> I keep forgetting. Damn, I appreciate this linguistics discussion being had in my chat right now. I appreciate that. I could have weapons, but that'll be dumb. Yeah. Okay. Nice. Good. Linguistics and politics can be interesting. And fun. Yeah, exactly. 100%. Yeah, it just depends on the people. Uh, this one is cannibals, so. I think, or like disease or something. Empty jump, lovely. Okay, we get a fight from that, thankfully. Guy indoors. Oh, okay. Loading, lovely. I'm gonna. Uh, it's probably too hack, too late to hack weapons, actually. Empty room, good. Ooh, six fuel is interesting. I might actually take that and a drone part. That's max fuel. I kind of like that, actually. Everyone speaks too fast for me, yeah. I'm gonna take that. Just because I, I need the fuel and that's max, so I think it's good to take that. I will let them live. I will show mercy this once. I put on clothes becomes I I clothes put on roughly in German and translated perfectly. <coughs> Interesting. I don't know that much German to, to, to know that. Yeah, I will not take that surrender. 18 scrap, very nice. Like that. Is the linguistics a nice change of pace from the FTL smut? I can talk dirty about that B if you'd like. No, it is a very nice change. Thank you, spicy lad. Yes, that's... <laughs> That's huge. Oh, and this is a nice uh, training ship here. Uh, although, yeah, actually, okay, we can actually crew fill this. Okay. 
Do we get this guy below 15? And his homie comes. Okay, he might have only gotten down to, uh, down to, uh, what, 20? Yeah, he's at 20. It's fine, though. So now this guy boards, and then we just kill him, and... I have jacket on. Whoa. That's deep. I already trained evasion, right? Yeah. Alright. Oh, come on, dude. They have a fast teleport. Yeah, this is this is doable here. Very nice. Goodbye. Nice. Hell yeah. That fight was so very safe. All right, we'll go to Nebula. Manually search. Having two crew, I think, would be a little too scary here. Sadly. Yeah. Can't do that sadly. Very sad. As I would have loved to. Alright, let's ignore. No fight. Okay. <coughs> Civilian, yes, thank you. Let's fucking go. Sorry guys, had to take a bite of the apple there. A lot of German is situation based to it being possessive now or in some other tense even. Interesting. Auto scout running. Safe fight. Very nice. We'll just shoot uh his pilot. Nice. I appreciate you guys talking about something like intellectual and interesting instead of just like being bored in the game. <laughs> it's very nice. Nice change of pace. Ooh, this is such a good event. Free stuff and then borders. Casual murder in the background. Yeah, horny for pixels, literally. It's so bad. I mean, I appreciate, I appreciate, uh, you know, the, 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 the occasional, uh, silly joke, even if it's, like, horny and kind of something, like, silly, but, I don't know. If it's, like, every single time you're in the chat, and it's, like, every, like, it's, like, 80% of what you talk about, I don't know, it becomes a little, gets a little, gets a little grating, I guess, I don't know, but I, I mean, I don't know, it's, it's fine. It's not the end of the world. Oh, that's an Artemis. Oops. Just being a codger. That's why the linguistics chat. Yeah, I get a palate cleanse. Being an old codger. Bummer about the medbay there, but what can you do? Trying to up the words per phrase. Yeah. <laughs> Nice. 
Well, two, two. Okay. There's a store. It's your chat gamer. I didn't know it was, that it was bothering you much. No, no, no. It's, no, it's, it's, uh, <laughs> it's fine. No, you'll dial back the horny. No, it's all good. I mean, it's fine. It's fine. Just like, as long as you're like being aware of it, you know, I don't know. <laughs> but I wasn't talking about you, spicy lad. I was talking about some other, some other, uh, hanger outers in the chat. Unfortunately, if I go here, I can't get cloaking. Even if I sell stuff, so I'm gonna try to get more scrap. Empty jump, okay. No cloaking. There's a flak, though. Okay. Maybe I just buy the flak. I kinda wanna sell the Lido and just. Yeah, get the scrap from that. You like to. You just like to yes and? Yeah, you're an improver. Double flak? Yeah. I think double flak is the play. Double flak is extremely strong. Thank you, Spicy Lad. I appreciate you being considerate. Always fun for just us. Got a piece of apple struck my tooth there. I can always sell back the flak too, if I need to. For something else, but... I hope I don't need to. Let's get that. Okay. Sweet. Okay, that's really, really strong. The enemy hates it, but their opinion doesn't matter. Yeah, exactly. This would be a good, maybe, maybe a good place to walk and talk. I don't know. Oh, that's an arty. Yeah. Ouch. Oh, I got the bomb off? Okay. Let's just vent it. Like this, you might wish to know how to build a pipe bomb. Oh, so true. Yeah. Oh my God, level three. Oh, level three. Oh two. That's insane. Oh, sure, just miss everything. have to get a resist here. Uh, you know, kill them. No resist. So. RIP drone part. I'm sorry I wasted you. I could maybe save for weapons 5, so I can do flak flak dual laser. Which gives me 8. Flak flak dual laser gives me 8 shots in 10 seconds for 5 power. That is fucking insane. That is so insane. Like, that's actually unreal, guys. I hope we can all appreciate the insanity that is Flak Flak Dual Laser. I don't know why I'm not charging Flak Flak here. Oh, my... God, fucking damn it, man. I... Dodge everything. Yeah, yeah, sure. That's so annoying. Violence is never the answer. Violence is the question, and the question is the answer is yes. Nah. No surrenders. Sorry, dog. You gotta die. You have transgressed. I 
doing uh, something like that. Oh, there's another store. One, two, three, four, five, six. What if I like go crazy for the store and I like dive into it? That would be kind of cool. I might try that. Did you jump? Oh, I forgot to get my guy in there. Good dodge, good dodge in the weapons. I oh, got this. Okay, no, no, no. Be there. Good. Oh, they have a motherfucking repair gun, dude. So annoying. Okay. I think Gracie is an ancestral name for Slugfoot. I don't know. It feels more like Polish. Slavic. so weak, dude. Do I need to upgrade hacking? Do I need to upgrade hacking here? Or weapons? No. No. Never surrender to slavers. Man, and this this would be a nice crew kit if I had like some gold to spare, but I don't think I can really afford to uh well, maybe. Let's try. Nice. Okay, got the RD off. That is an RD. Thank you, Scout. Nice. So he's gonna try to repair that. And then I think once the teleport pulls down, he'll come board us. Nice. Nice. Come board. Kill you. Okay, level one phone day, very good. Kill this guy. What do you repair? One day. Hell yeah. 31. Okay. 31 scrap. Want to try to go to the store? Or do we want to? I mean, I gotta go to the exit first, but okay. No, this could be an ASB and just kill us. So, Zoltan homewards or Zoltan? Man, are you fucking kidding me? Or are you actually shitting me? I probably have to go to the store here to dive, but I have to. I have to repair and upgrade hacking. I think. All right, uh, or weapons. Is this the Satan run? I don't know. I mean, it's, it's not so terrible because we got hacking, but I mean, it's pretty bad. Well, it's not bad. I'm just taking chip damage. It's, yeah, okay. Reject their offer. Weapon hack. That looks like a breach. If we take two of those, we die. Why did I not hack? Oh, okay, we got it off. Nice. Oh, there's a fire. Nice. But I'll take that off. That'll come on. We're gonna go in there. And they should actually, um... They should get stuck in there, if I'm not mistaken. Unless they put out the fire fast enough. Maybe they do. See if we can kill them. Oh, we might be able to crew kill them. Yeah, if we hit them one more time, there will be a crew kill there. Or two times. 
Nice. Oh shit, we actually kind of... We're 10 away from cloaking. We can't get cloaking because there's no cloaking. But we're gonna repair up to like here. Let's get some drone parts. And then, um, well, let's do this. Yeah. That seems good. I think. Okay, after this sector, I'm gonna go to bed. Like, we need to escape the dive, get to Zoltan 4, and then I'm going to bed, because Zoltan 4 is going to be brutal, so. I'm gonna start, well, I can always start the Sky Indoors, but. And then he's not on engines, giving us maximum uh, speed for charging. I don't know. Holy shit, those are some weapons. They're not boarding us, that's really good. There's unfortunately nothing we can do in terms of like, being able to be guaranteed safety from the ASB. Or apparently their weapons. Oh, this could be really bad. ASB. What is the hit? Nice dodge, dude. That's so huge. It's actually massive right there. The dodge kill engines. Okay. Give me out. Can I kill this guy? Hold on. Alright, yeah, give me out. Alright, let's go Zoltan Homeworld so we have the choice of Sector 5, and I'm going to bed, guys. I'm so tired. I don't want to blunder the streak on a misplay that I wouldn't have made if I wasn't super tired, so. Let's repair up. Let's assess the situation. I'm going to think about it a little bit before I go to bed. Don't want the singular fuel. <laughs> yeah, no, not worth it. Run seems super tough. It's pretty tough, yeah. It's pretty tough. Well... I mean, it's a, it's it's not so bad, honestly. I'm just I'm a little tired, and I'm just kind of like getting a little tilted from all the damage we've been taking. But like, we have hacking, so we just need to level up hacking a little bit, and we'll be good. Like, look at these weapons, you know. The issue kind of is just in the fact that we are having trouble dealing consistently, like consistently dealing targeted damage to certain rooms. Because if we want to damage like a two by one weapon room, our flak is going to be missing pretty regularly. So. But honestly, it's not so bad. We need more flak ones, exactly. If we get one more, this thing will really pop off. But yeah, Zoltan sector can be one of the toughest sectors in the early to mid game. No shield is safe. Yeah, quad flak one. That's, it's so epic when that happens. It's rare when that happens, but when it does, it's fucking awesome, so. But yeah, anyways. This is run, uh, what, uh, 50? 40, no, 49. So yeah, thanks everyone for watching. It's been a lot of fun hanging out with you guys. Hope you have a great night. And I will be back uh, on Tuesday for the stream uh, to finish this run. So yeah, hope you guys sleep well. Have a great start to your week. And uh, yeah, take care. Thanks for, thanks for hanging out, guys. Peace out. Yo, what is going on, everyone? Welcome back. Hope you're all doing well. We are back with another, uh, oops, let me get the game going here. We are back with another FTL hard mode with pause, uh, ship streak run, random ship streak run. Jeez, this thing's big. Okay. So welcome back. Uh, in our last stream, we defeated the, uh, Federation C, or sorry, Federation A, and, uh, today we will be... Finishing our run of Excuse me. I just noticed the date on this is wrong. Sorry. So sorry for that. We'll be finishing our fed B run, which we started last time you Know the background rebel ships which shape of them do you prefer the blocky one or the 2d one? <laughs> <coughs> I like this one Yeah, I like that one So, uh, yeah, we uh, we uh we're feeling a little bit sketchy in our current run, but uh, it's it's honestly, it's not so bad. If you're a Blocky fan, I'm assuming this is Blocky, this is Toothy, but I'm not 
Sure, okay, so here we were. Okay, I remember why it's feeling a little sketchy. We have starting crew, we're in Zoltan 4, and uh, we don't have cloaking. We have, um, oh, let me turn some stuff down, hold on. We have uh, <clears throat> two flax and dual lasers, which is awesome, and we do have hacking, which is really, really good. But, uh, you know, otherwise, we're, we're a little bit, I don't know. It feels a little vulnerable, I guess, I guess you could say, so. Um, of course, we're going to be starting with our human on doors, and probably, I should probably prevent some stuff, I don't know, because Zoltan Border Police can be kind of nasty. Must have fallen asleep last stream, I don't remember, Fed B. You did fall asleep, yeah. Didn't you wake up in the middle of the stream last time, or, or no, my mis- Maybe that was during the rock run or something, I don't know. Run has been scuffed, it's not that bad. I was just getting tired, I was getting a little tilted last time, so... I think that's part of why it felt a little a little scuffed. Also, I, I rearranged my like second monitor, so now it's tall instead of instead of wide. So that's interesting. I think it's helping with my ergonomics. Oh, that was when I streamed with Lacey. That's right. That's right. Okay. So yeah, I mean we're in sector four. We're honestly not in a bad spot. We just need to like live and find cloaking, and you know we'll be good. Uh, we could go to the nebula. Maybe let's greet up in the nebula a little bit before we check for stores. I don't know, but if this if that's the store, that could be a little sad. So let's let's go here. Do I recommend the vertical second monitor? Uh oh shit, is this a weapon? Yeah, it's nice. I like it. Oh, come on, low roll bullshit. Low roll bullshit. Okay, that is a disconnected jump. So even if that is the store, I don't even know if we could get to it. That's really fucking stupid, actually. But there are two stores, so... That's good to know. Like, there's one there. There could be one there, but... Otherwise, we should be able to see most of them. That one might be a little inaccessible, but... Alright. Alright. Rebels have penetrated into Uncharted Space. Whoa. They've done what into Uncharted Space, guys? Did you, did you hear that? My unwrap, man. The writer for this for this event must have been like, what's what's the most fuckable part of space? The uncharted parts, I guess. Wait, that's crazy. That upends the the theory that uncharted is not the most fuckable sector. I don't know where it ranked in your guys's. Okay, I don't know where it ranked in your guys's uh, rankings or whatever. Should probably hack weapons. <laughs> Don't abuse words in the Bible. Okay. Guess I probably want to shoot this. Nice. That is actually freaking ideal. That makes the fight fully safe, so. Dude, these flax are so fast. What the hell? Oh, we just shot the drone. Cool. And then missed everything. None of these words are in the Bible. Yeah. Hold on. Get our get our shit adjusted here. So guys, I'm a. Uh, so I have a question for for you guys watching. Okay. How much FTL YouTube content do you currently watch, and how interested are you in like. Like how satisfied are you with said content? Like, do you feel like your 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 interests are being satisfied as FTL viewers on YouTube? Okay, this is important. Because I have been having some crazy revelations lately about FTL on YouTube and don't watch much of any FTL YouTube content. Maybe like the occasional mind blowing shit hopefully cooks up better than that now. Okay. How interested would you be like like do you feel like you don't watch that stuff because you're just not super interested? Or, um, because the stuff that you would be interested in watching is not on YouTube right now. Most FTL tubers are super noobs, yeah. I agree with that. That's like, that's the thing. There's like, a, so much content made by, after knowing the pro strats, you can't watch someone play bad. Oh, here's the guy scared of the border police. After watching, uh, yeah, yeah, like, there's so much content made by people who are not very, like, 
yeah, like, not in a rude way, but there's there's a lot of content that's been made by people who are not super good at FTL, like, honestly. And, uh, nice. That's ideal. And, uh, like, and again, it makes sense because the majority of people who play FTL are not super good, you know? Wow, I'm saying dodges. But, um, the thing is, it, 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 it makes it, like you said, Ratman. Yeah, saw a video that said FTL system tier list and click bait thumb here with shields F tier. Yeah, yeah. Well, there's a lot of, like, of, uh, tier lists about FTL. Crows, I feel like, are the pretty much the main good ones. Um... Maybe there's some other solid ones, but... Uh... Sorry, um... But, uh... What do I keep looking back? Uh, Yoshi was pooping, so I wanted to make sure she was okay. Remember when I was first watching FTL YouTube tier list? First thing that came up from the guy, Spearmints, and it's clear he's... Yeah, no, he... Spearmints is, was not... Spearmints was also someone I watched when I was first getting kind of into FTL, and... He was, uh... Definitely a kind of a baiter. Uh, well, not a baiter, but yeah, he, he wasn't really that good at the, yeah, yeah, I mean, he, he wasn't, like, a super high-level player. Like, he put Lanius B in, like, his D tier of, of his ships or whatever, and I was like, okay, sure. Uh, I don't want to take that fight now, that's, it's a dumb fight. Um, yeah, Master Baiter, exactly, exactly. Um, well, let's go store crazy, I guess. Um, but... Um, oh, this isn't too bad. Uh, that's probably an Artemis, though, right? That's annoying. Depending on the level of focus. Okay, you know what? I might, I might hack this. Does he know? Chat, does he know? What? Do I know what? Master Bader? Yeah, of course, dude, I know. What are you talking about? What do you mean, do I know? Well, what's wrong? Dude, are you... F Oh my, oh my god, dude. Come on. Really? Really, FTL? Oh, that's not gonna hit, is it? Oh, it is. Thought I'd make a bigger deal masturbator? No. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, so anyways, the reason I'm asking is because I think there is an incredibly broad, untapped potential in the FTL niche on YouTube. I, I think it's, I think, I really think that to be true and I want to explore that more and I want to make videos that people are interested in watching about FTL you know all right we're doing hacking too there I think hacking too is definitely the way I still haven't seen the store um promise to help oh we don't we don't have a, a blue option for this do we I think we don't uh fire on the defense yeah, we, we want NG or Ion for this, or Cloaking. Ion, Cloaking, Advanced Cloaking. Oh, wow. So we could take five damage. I don't want to take whole damage right now, no. For low scrap, hell no. Do tier lists? Yeah, I would do some tier lists at some point. I would want to make sure that I would, like, bring my own sort of unique identity to that, but... Yo, Bonsoir. Bonsoir? Bon, bonsoir, eh? What's up, Spicy? Welcome to the chat, dude. Alright, Zoltan Pirates. Oh, I forgot to man my doors again. I'm terrible. But yeah, anyways, yeah, I've been thinking about how it how deficient Oh, that's an Artemis, goddammit. How deficient the YouTube Nice dodge, nice dodge. Oh nice, the bomb didn't even go off. Yeah, just how deficient the, uh, oh, is that a Zoltan? I guess that makes sense. Thank you, Zoltan. Okay, three fuel and two drum parts is actually kind of sick, but I think being greedy is kind of important here. Um, yeah. So anyways, that's kind of, that was kind of my main point that I wanted to get across, is just, I'm interested in creating high quality YouTube content related to FDL that people are going to be interested in watching. And uh, I just, I don't know, I kind of wanted, okay, nice, we got the fuel. I kind of, I wanted to gauge people's opinions and interest thing for their lives. Ign <laughs> ignores, yeah, no, fuck those guys. Um, so yeah, so I'm, I'm creating a, a viewer survey. Okay, there's a store. I'm creating a survey. One, oh, do we have that? Yeah, we should have that, two and a half. 
so one yeah what do we even get from the store though i mean just repairs i guess right so i'm creating a survey that uh will will gauge people's interest in ftl content on youtube and i want to sort of probe sorry not like that but i want to get i want to gauge people's ideas of and perceptions of of you know the deficiencies of of ftl currently and uh, of ftl youtube and what it could what it's lacking what people want to see and uh yeah <clears throat> probed by am yeah exactly so yeah anyways uh we could do battery sure we'll do battery and then I'll, i will spend the rest on a drone part and two repairs okay that shouldn't be a dive oh nice hear them out next sector let's go okay we could get zoltan shield which would be a huge get okay isn't this the ship we just saw oh no i guess the other ship had heavy laser one but okay, okay we, we should be able to get this missile nice collected 10k scrap in 11 hours of ftl spicy is that true are you dead ass rat man refuse to believe you've taken even a single surrender the hell has spicy really gotten that much fucking scrap in that little time come on fucking auto scout oh my god you cock you cock on a block dude eh get him no 10k scrap achievement 11 hours on scene that is insane man what the hell spicy you're a monster oh sure just hammer my weapons it's fine Good, thank you. Asshole. Don't feel like FTL is very well followed on YouTube, but this scene is super interesting. Modding, challenge runs, street the races. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, no, I mean, there's, there's a lot of, like, interesting stuff already, but I just feel like... I feel like what is really lacking is the, like... That sort of style of, like, high quality, but also, like... Like, because, okay... Like, Mike and Crow, right? Two of the best players that this game has ever seen. They have made so many videos. Is that a lot for the time? What do you... Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that is a lot, Spicy Lad. Probably. Yeah, that's actually a, a ton. Um, okay, like, Crow and Mike have made a ton of amazing, super valuable videos that have helped so many people improve at FTL, right? But... The thing is, their videos are not super edited, right? They're not super, they're not designed to be like super engaging or accessible for a wide like audience of people. Especially not people who might not have played FTL that much before. Which makes sense because they're for high level players. So it makes sense that they would appeal to a more niche audience and, and not, you know. But um, what I think would be really cool is bringing high level, like bringing the perspectives of high level FTL players to a, a more like, a, a wider audience like a more accessible engaging format where yeah you know i don't know i and i i think uh i think it's i'm gonna buy the the fuel there abandoned or rebel five fuck me up the ass i mean we probably go rebel here for for this being the purple the the green seven this is really kind of freaky though eh, abandoned might be less immediately dangerous we have two shields we don't have cloaking abandoned does have two stores Rebel 5 is real dangerous. Ugh, man. I don't know. We have three crew. I mean, yeah, but... Yeah, we have 022. What are we going to do against being Lanius boarded? Can't uh, 022 counter? If we open all the doors? That counters the... Counters the 02. I guess, I guess mind control is annoying, but we could also hack mind control if we wanted. Uh... Oh, that sucks. One Lanny border. Yeah, because it's it's abandoned level it's abandoned sector five, so. Um let's see, let's see. Lanius uh shield. Okay, so Lanius bombers show crew. So they will board with two crew, Ratman. You have deceived me. Banned. Banned. Someone ban that guy. You mean like what? Yeah, if they have four crew, they will board with two. Right? 
Oh, if we, well, if we, like, hack mind control. Level 202 completely counteracts one landing border. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay, okay, my bad, my bad. <sighs> I mean, these both just have very dangerous fights, and then... I don't know, man. It's tough. You think Rebel is still the play? Uh, Rebel 5 is real dangerous, though. I don't know. I mean, our weapons are fast and strong, but... And we have hacking, which affords us some safety. Abandon is a higher crew kill risk? I guess so. Like my idea of bringing high-level FTL to the masses. It's honestly a fascinating topic. Right, Spicy. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah. And I think... Uh, I, yeah, I just think it's really uncharted territory. We can recover from whole damage easier than crew death. That's true. But I mean, the rebel sector has that one event that gives us three rebel borders plus potentially a boarding ship. So four rebel borders or like two two to three rebel border rebel borders, like event borders plus ion like a rebel disruptor with an ion intruder and hacking. No one's going to care about Lee FTL strats, or very, very few people will. Well, that's not necessarily true, Ratman. I mean, people will watch a lot of stuff on YouTube. There's a reason our community is so small. Yeah, and I, I, I think that a big part of that is because the ideas of high-level FTL have not... Like, if you can find me an accessible, highly edited, engaging video that would be interesting to someone who hasn't played FTL, or, like, who, who doesn't know much about FTL, maybe, like, a beginner FTL player, if you can find me a video like that, then, you know, you win. But I just... No, be, the Hot Please Beginner's Guide doesn't count. What I'm talking about is presenting the concepts and the, like, strategic thinking that goes into high-level FTL play while also being, like, edited, engaging, and... Or maybe, like, scripted, that kind of thing, you know? Like, because a lot of... Like, for example, Crow's videos are, are very... I mean, a lot of them are taken from his live streams. They're not scripted. They're not edited, you know? And that's not to diminish the that's not to diminish the quality of what Crow talks about or his understanding of the game at all. You know, I'm just just in terms of the actual like content of it. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. It's like what Spicy Lad is saying, like Summoning Salt or Carl Yopes or whatever. You know, those guys talk about or or uh, you know Cosmic. He talks about like Super Mario's uh, Super Mario Bros. speed run speed runs and like the tech the tech that goes into that. I watch those videos. I don't fucking play Super Mario Bros. I don't care about Super Mario Bros. Really. I mean, I, I just think the videos are interesting, right? And I feel like people, this is a, this is a known classic of the genre. People know that this game is a, a classic roguelite. They know that it's a good game. They know that, and maybe people know that. Like, I, I think what FTL is maybe known for very well is that it's like very difficult, right? And so. I think if someone came on YouTube and demystified that, uh, then, yeah, I think people would be interested in that. Could be a good niche. Been thinking of making it since I, fir since I first found you. Yeah, Spicy Lad, that would be dope, dude. The algorithm play you might recommend. Yeah. Yeah, that would be super cool, dude. Okay, I'm stalling this decision. Uh, I'm not sure what to do. Ah, uh, man. Um... Rebel is just the play. I don't know, Ratman. Like I said, crew kill versus whole kill risk. I think we could get crew kill, crew killed or whole killed in either sector. I mean, we could roll a Lanius bomber with two, like two burst laser twos and a flak one or something, or we could, you know, in mind control cloaking and teleporter, or we could roll like a rebel disruptor that, you know. Like, a, that, there's that one boarding event in Rebel Sectors where you get boarded by the, and they say Federation Scum, you know, and you get free event boarders. Recover from hull damage easier than crew death. I agree, but I'm just, like, I think this is just as risky. Less likely for us to get crew killed in Rebel 5. All right. What's the most yellow pick? I just, I don't know. Um, I'll go Rebel, I guess. I'll go Rebel. I, I don't know. That way, if we lose the streak, I can blame Ratman. <laughs> <laughs> alright, alright. 
Every elder warns of the abandoned sector is true. Alright. Here we go. Enough stalling. All eyes on you, yeah. Empty jump. Alright, great start. Okay, great start. Okay, it's a fire beam. This is actually a pretty safe fight. Probably just want to hack weapons here. Boss clicked four of your own streaks, so not a problem. <laughs> Big fight, easy peasy, exactly. That is an Artemis. Hack this motherfucker. Oh, just miss everything. That's, that's also fine. Yeah. Totally cool. You know, I have put out, um, I have, like, taken down a system bar in, like, on a auto ship with just fire before. Like, that's actually happened. It's pretty cool. Ratman, what's your longest streak? Miss, yeah, true. Miss, 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 miss. A British schoolboy asking to go to the restroom. Miss, miss, miss. Miss, I gotta use the loo. Nimb4, currently on your PB. Let's go, Ratman. PB hype. It, yeah, and vanilla. Post, <laughs> it's like, it's like the old days of the internet. Post physique. Post win rate. Post win rate, Ratman. Oh, I forgot to. Never streak vanilla. You should. It's fun. Ratman, what if I like tried to what if I tried to proselytize you into playing vanilla as much as you talk about Well, no, I guess you don't specifically proselytize people into playing multiverse, but what if I was like what if I went up to every like multiverse video on YouTube and was like, have you tried vanilla? Have you tried vanilla? It's like multiverse one. <laughs> uh fuck yeah. Okay, this is awesome. Okay, actually, this is not uh we this is like, these ships have been actually really chill, I have to say. I'm getting evangelical here about vanilla. Preemptively banned from MV Discord. <laughs> oh, you know what? This is gonna sync up, isn't it? Nope, not if I shoot it. All right, we're chilling. The Jeff Bezos of our fiefdom. 10K channel points, let's go. Wait, what did you say, Spicy Lad? Lamal what, I pull the most oddly funny shit. What was that referring to? I need to remember so I can make funny jokes again in the future. These guys are getting mowed down. English schoolboy, miss, miss. Can I go to the bath? Oh, yeah. <laughs> miss. That was kind of an, uh, 34. Ooh, that is a juicy reward, dude. Oh my god. That was partially inspired by Michael Rosen. Ask Hopley, he can confirm. Nah, uh, he'll call me racist against British. Nah, I'm just kidding. Big, okay. All right, we are gonna take our first break of the evening. We will be back in three minutes, folks. Never expects when I'm gonna take shit, singing or otherwise. <laughs> um. Oh, where I'm gonna take shit. Oh, of course, of course, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Spicy. Yeah, I'm marking my FTL bingo. Uh, okay, we are gonna take a quick break. Uh, I might not pee, so, you know, don't, uh, don't assume that about me, but uh, we will be right back, so stay tuned, and I will, I will see you after the quick ad break.
All right, we are back. Welcome back from the break, everyone. I don't know what you guys are talking about in the chat, about some some monster or whatever, some jump scare. I don't know what that was. Uh, I was just, yeah, I texted Lacey, and uh, I actually did end up going to the bathroom. You peed, didn't you? You did, admitted Cower. I did, I did, I'm sorry. I lied, I haven't been entirely honest. I did pee. I did eye cup, I, I, I cupped all over the place. All right. Demand the surrender of their goods. Uh, gotta make sure the, the angle is perfect here. Speaking of iCup, we should definitely do another game game night. Absolutely, dude. 7.4k crystal aid, 2.5 scrap, three upgrades off from ma max out chip. Jesus Christ, am I nice word. All right. They don't want to. They don't want to fight. Okay. Yeah, these guys definitely don't want to fight. That's why they're boarding my ship. These guys are true pacifists. Come on, man. What the fuck is that? No, don't go back into piloting, dude. still isn't working must have been the malware they installed onto my pc due to the events of the 2020 summer what the hell are you talking about tonight nice double fire that's huge that actually will probably spread and uh lead to their weapons burning down like all the way actually that's pretty epic we can get them in there dude Hold on. nice oh that guy's dead yes oh, that's massive Oh, yeah, dude. Let's go. Come on now. Come on, baby. Oh, this is epic. Dude, these guys are so fucked. Are they still alive? Yeah, I was, like, all scared of of this fight, but uh, I, I, I then remembered uh, that we, we have... Um, we have... Two flax and hacking <laughs> and dual lasers. Oh, this is a crew kill. Uh, actually, wait, this ship might burn down. Yeah, these are about to burn down, aren't they? No! Oh, no. If I start a fire. Wait, no. No! Fuck. Okay, well, I'm not punished. It was a crew kill if I just waited. Yep, yeah, um, that happened again. Impatient rookie. Yep. Yeah. That's true, Samith. It's true. I'm, I am an impatient rookie. How did you know? Impatient. You spelled impatient wrong. It's spelled impatient. More hold-in systems burning down. That's true. That's true. Fuck. Damn, I, I, I got blindsided. I got blindsided. We still got the drone, so it's okay. Oh, this is the event that I was talking about. Okay. Okay, they boarded into O2. We are going to hack weapons. Oh, yeah, they're double board. See, this is the event, Rat Man. Like, how how is this less scary than Alania's bomber? This is like pretty much equally scary. And see, they're gonna board into piloting. Well, you know what? I won't vent yet. We have level two O2. They don't have hacking or mind control. Well, that is true. That is true. Alania's bombers don't have hacking, but. Yeah, they do have mind control, so I guess that's your point there. Where do they want? Why are they going there? Don't they want to unite with each other? Less scary, but it's still very shit. Yeah, absolutely. True, yeah, cloaking on this would be kind of a cock blocker. Okay, it looks like they want, like, shields now. Or th these guys want piloting, I guess. Orders are about three times easier to deal with. That is true, that is true. Come on, all the dodges. Okay, 
Now we run out of piloting into the med bay. We get these guys. These guys are fucked. These guys should go home. Come on, Cooper. Get him in the med bay. Nice. Okay, maybe this is a crew kill. Maybe I can atone for the sins of my past. The sins of my forefathers. I gotta get this down first. Good, okay. Oh, it's a Lido, huh? Okay. Nice. Padre will be happy. Yeah. He better be. Come on. Challenge run idea? What's up? Fire? No fire. I have to play Fed Cruiser. Only use artillery for those ships. Okay, no crew kill. It's fine. That was not so bad, actually. Two flax, man. No damage, actually. That's really good. We did not see down here. What was this quest again? Oh, this is the Zoltan Shield quest, isn't it? One, two, three. Oh, actually, I, I have to choose right now. Unless this is safe somehow, which I don't I don't think this this is gonna be overtaken, I'm like very confident. Do I do I risk not seeing the sector store or getting Zoltan Shield? I think it's live. You think so? Uh, maybe. Feels sketchy. It feels like it could be. But yeah, like, if I go here and this be- Well, you know, even if this does become a dive, maybe I just die for it just to see these. Because I, I really want to find my store. I want to find Chloe. But I'm going for- I'm going for the guaranteed value. Hail them. Reconciliation. No bloodshed. Oh, boom! Strike! Actually, that's a home run. That's not a strike. How long are deviled eggs good at room tip temp? Uh, spicy lad, generally, you're gonna want to go with about uh, a max threshold of about two hours. Uh, anything after that, you're risking the development of uh, potentially, you know, infectious, harmful uh, pathogens, um, bacteria and tox bacteria and toxins. Yeah, eat them sooner rather than later, or put them in the fridge. Massive dub, huge, large, massive, titanic, colossal, continental, capital, exactly. Capital, capital. What if I retired? Why would you retire, Samai? Oh, it's not a dive, never punished, never punished. <gasps> Boom, bitch. It's not a dive, baby. Only been at room temp for like four-ish hours. Okay. Big white beacon. Oh, dude, we're making so much fucking money, this sector, dude. We're so rich. We have such fat stacks right now, dude. What doesn't kill you makes you stronger. There's an argument to be made for that as well. Just eat them anyways. I know a lot of people who just don't care about that kind of stuff, and I'm like, like, I don't know how you do that. The beacon is touching tips, literally. They're docking. Not in an FTL way either. Oh, we just killed all those guys. Working in a kitchen, I've snacked on way older shit. Oh, O2. <laughs> I did not just say that, I did. I said what I said, Maya. There's our store. I, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. And that could be our only store for this sector, so I gotta go there, obviously. Oh, I'm not gonna go. Boom! Boom, baby! That's what I'm talking about. And there's a breach, too, for crew killing the flagship. Which is also, that's also just a good weapon. Okay, we buy the cloaking. Now let's see, what do we buy? What do we buy? Fire beam? I mean, this is way better for crew killing, Ratman. Well, you know, they are both two power. This is slightly cheaper. This is just slower and uh, less reliable, I feel like. But also, this can't miss. Um, breach bomb costs bomb. Fire beam is more fun, way more fun. I mean, yeah, I don't know. A breach 2 is like so good, dude. Yeah, breach is better. Yeah. Auto reloader. 
Breach doesn't spread. You know, that's true, MRA6. Yeah, I don't know. Fire does spread. My main quandaries with Fire Beam is, is just that it's slower and... Well, I guess it's just slower. Breaches don't go out. True. It's gonna spread me in a second here. Oh, reload are also an option. Yeah. Breaches do not go out. That is true. They force they they're forced to repair those. Although flagship has a O two two. What's up, Drip Rats? Oh, sorry, O two three. Hope you're doing well. We just came at the turning point of the run in the Rebel Sector Five, where we found cloaking, got the Zoltan Shield quest, and have not taken damage since like the start of the sector. And we also have two flags, breaching the bio killing protocols. Whoa. Yeah, Drip Rats. What, what's your vote here? What do you go for? Breach two or fire fire beam. Either works. I'm just inclined to take the cheaper option, but I just I feel like this is I, I don't nah this is I'll go breach I'll go breach. <laughs> Do we even need need either? I mean I would like to have one. Yes, I I I think it's actually really valuable to have something that like guarantees you the ability to you know consistently kill the the flagship. So. Uh, I could have repaired more there. I, I should have repaired. Auto scout in the uh, asteroid field. I'm such a slut for winning. Don't shame my win rate, please. Don't. <laughs> Breach fan, useful versus auto ships. True. In fact, I could use it here. That's what I wanted. Win rate sexual. Imagine getting hit at 95 there, that would have been so cringe. Yo, what's up, Farb? Whoa. I see what you did there, Farb. What's up, Doc? How's it going? Come on, dude! Oh my god! These motherfuckers. Okay, I was about to say maybe I should flash, but it's going for shields anyway, so. Got hit through 97%. That's fucked up. Barb, how did your run go earlier? I had to dip early. I uh, I went to uh, Mr. Ram's stream to, to watch his streak run. New wants more for Jack Jackbox, but I see you're doing very important things right now. Yes, I am. Sorry, Doc. Sorry. Sorry, Mathnasium. Uh, yeah. I did see that message, but yes, I, this this is on the this is on my schedule, way in advance. Fed C was a five and a half hour run. Jesus Christ, nice work, dude. I thought you were saving all the bad ships for later in the later in the, uh, the stream, but I guess uh, you wanted to get that one out of the way. Oh yeah, that has like four buffers. May have forgotten Fed C existed. Yeah. Nice. Oh, it's cloaking three. That makes sense. Oh, okay. I cloaked way too late there. I cloak. Was the was Fedsy like a actually bad run, or was it just like did you just play slow, or was it both? Nice reward. Wind shaming. <laughs> I saw that the spicy lad. That's funny. All right, let's get the get the pirates. Arr, we be pirates. We be create a negative social impact. Arr, arr, arr. We plunder your scrap and your booty. Impressive barrage. True. Impressive lack of dodge. And only hacking a support through sector five. Made some mistakes that made it shaky earlier. It was actually pretty okay. Just had to play slow. Hell yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah, I've I've been there. I've, I've I know I know that kind of run. It can be very scary. Okay, thank you, Zoltan Shield, for blocking the ion there. <clears throat> the ion bomb. Yeah, brother called Nirb. Ha 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 ha. Using 
like stunner and ion blast would deal two for a while after second five. But after that, it was pretty okay. I was doing a lot of zolt and micro. Okay, that's nice. Are you first power in second five? Nice! Yes! We need crew, baby. Thank you. Thank you, dude. That's huge. Not anymore. What happened? Oh, right. The accident. I forgot about that. Nothing was the same after near was lost in the accident. The bite of 87. No questions. My bad, my bad. Oh, okay. This guy's a little, little gross. A little stinky. There's something to be said for maybe popping a breach here. Nice. Huge, dude. Huge. That's literally so good. Oh, the Zoltan Shield absorbs that. Oh, wow. What the fuck? How did I not know that? What the hell? Are you gonna get him? Get him. Get him! Kill, 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 murder. <sighs> yes. Die, Biznatch. Bloodlust and slaughter. Oh wow, the Zoltan Shield blocked it again. Let's go. Murder. Oh, and now he wants out. What a dummy. Okay, I gotta just let this guy ride. Let it ride. No! I'm a fool! Fuck. No, don't go in there. Oh, wait, I have a breach. <laughs> I have a breach. Oh, he's on fire? No, wait, this is gonna burn! Did I just see another fumbled crew kill? You probably did, Smythe. Yeah, I think you did. I'm a real fuck up. Oh, no. No, wait, we're in there. We're in there. He, he put the fire out. He put the fire out. No! How did he know? Get him, get him. Wait, okay, go to sensors, you frick, you frick face. You love chihuahuas? Oh, dude, we got this guy, we got this guy. Hold up, hold up. Osted, you're be about to be an Osted. Die, die. Hoo! Doubter, you're a doubter, Samith, you're a doubter. You doubted too hard. All dogs are deranged, but I don't like animals like that. That is cringe. Sorry, dude. Dogs are man's best friend. Inquire. Reactor for 18. I will take that. Oh, I love you, civilian. I love you. Civilian sector six is man's best friend, but then dogs are second best friends. So far, still actively spent money to achieve that crew kill. That's true, Samite. That's true. Have you considered not being a hater, though? I'm just kidding. I'm just teasing. I'm just teasing. Though. I'm lusting over Civ six. I'm lusting, whatever you want to call it. It's uh, gonna help me win the game, so. Well, it's not about the type of sector, it's about how you use it. It's not about the amount of scrap, it's how you use it. That's what my dad always used to say. What got auto modded in that message? Bite me? Oh yeah, the part about, yeah, bite me, yeah. Oh yeah, this, this is actually safe. SMH Twitch, yeah. They always assume the worst, right? Oh, okay, we shot one of their ion shots. That was actually calculated. Super calculated. Okay, check this out. Insane tech right here. I didn't need to do that, but I just felt like it. 
Last two times you walked by a dog on the street, one was constantly side-eyeing you and the other tried to bite you. Well, that sounds like a you problem, right, man? You probably smelled like chicken or something. Walking, trying to mind your own business. Okay, well, that that's either a you problem, because you smelled like chicken, or you looked weak and they smelled your fear. Or, um... Uh... The owners were negligent or abused them. But it's not the dog's fault. When you blame it on the dog, that's, yeah. Insane tech, including basic FTL mechanics. Exactly, Smythe. You figured out the code. I think we might skip that store. Blame it on the hog. True. Well, this is a rather terrifying ship. Uh, what do I hack here? Probably, um... Probably weapons. Dodge. Nice. This is gonna still be up, but... <clears throat> Unless they have a bomb hiding. Get the beam drone down. Okay. Blame it on the Henny. Oh my god, yes. I'm sorry if I just fucked you guys in the ears. That is two runs in a row where, where we got a free flak. Was it one of these also free? No, I, I bought I bought both of these, right? Yeah, I, I bought both of these. All right, well that's epic. Those guys know how to bargain. Is triple flak even good? <laughs> yeah. No, it sucks. It's a terrible build. Yeah, it's pretty trash. Can I even get that on right now? Yeah, I can. Yeah, it's pretty weak. Um. Yeah, it's it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. Oh, okay, actually. Actually, okay, no, there is a point there in that we, we can't really target a lot of damage into one place. Because we only have dual lasers, right? And actually, if we upgrade weapons right now, we can only do two, three flax or, like, our current wep weapon setup with a, with a buffer. Remember when I played FTL casually, it always missed wherever I wanted it to shoot. It's actually unironically asked if you can just have two other precise weapons in addition to the six shots. Two flax and two heavies, noticeably stronger than three flax and one heavy. Is this a troll? Well, okay, maybe it's inaccurate, but I, I don't think that's the same as it being bad. And like, yeah, I mean, okay, yeah, sure, the inaccuracy is a, is, is a big deal. No, you're right, you're right, yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, I, th I think this is still good. It's just hype, it's hype. But my bad for being excited, Samith. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah. It's just hype to see a free black because it's a really good weapon. Makes me happy. One of. Thank you for apologizing. Of course, spicy lad. Let's do the second, sh uh, the third shield here. Do I go to the store? I could go repair. I could also not. Yeah, I'll, I'll just go repair. Let's see what's up. Small bombs, scanners, stealth weapons. Interesting. Could sell a flak for stealth weapons. You guys, fuck with stealth weapons. Hope we can rank your YouTube apology in the future. True. YouTuber apology tier list. Burst Laser 2 better. Uh, Burst Laser 2 is... It's hard to say which one is better. Flak fires in 10 seconds without manning. Uh, Burst Laser 2 fires in 12. Flak is 3 non-targeted shots that hit, a, like, hit a radius. Burst Laser 2 is targeted. It also has fire chance. Flak, two does, uh, flak 1 does not. Um, Flak 1 is 65 scrap, Burst Laser 2 is 80. 
Um, Burst Laser 2 is also rarer. It's, it's one of the more rare weapons in the game. I think it has a rarity of 4, whereas Flak has a rarity of like 1. So this is one of the most common things you see in the game. So, you know, I think... I mean, I ultimately, like, I end up using Flak more. And, uh... Like I said, it, it's less rare, but... <clears throat> uh... Yeah, thanks for the analysis, no problem. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. It's, but again, like... Like Samite said, like, three of... Oh, that's really good. Three Flax is really hard to aim. Um, okay, <laughs> wow. That's crazy. These are two of the rarest weapons in the game. Imagine if this was Glaive Burst Laser 3 Vulcan. Still haven't beat the game on hard mode. Are you uh, trying to do that flame, flame within? Or X flame, flame with, with I? Because uh, yeah, I, I I would I would I would I'd be happy to share any you know tips or if you have any questions about anything that you're not sure about in FTL, you know I'd be happy to help you improve on that front or uh, share information with you. All the targeted damage we need plus three flax. True, we would just need ten weapon power for that. No, sorry, thirteen weapon power. No, yeah, ten. By Vulcan Chan. No, I'm good. Um, yeah. Hints, tips, tricks, and more at twitch.tv slash empower67. True. True. Get engines four there. I'll finish repairing. Why the hell not? Why don't I have a YouTube command? Oh, that's true. I should do that. What should it say? <laughs> oh, these guys have hacking. Oh, this is actually safe without the drone. And depending on what they hack. Okay, battery. So let's do uh, you and I. Exclamation mark YouTube and just a link. Don't subscribe. True reverse psychology, my viewers. Don't subscribe. Don't subscribe. You don't want to subscribe. You're not interested in my YouTube videos. Yeah, we have a great catalog of uh, exclamation mark cl c commands. Clamps? What the fuck are clamps? Die. Average vet range. So true. You guys see Rand's uh, streak loss today? It was a real bummer, I have to say. More fuel? Okay. I need a free flak with that deal, sir. Or a free, free burst laser, free hover beam. You did, it was so sad, yeah. It was a bummer, man. It was a tough one. Thirty-three. Okay. What happened? Uh, he had a tough run on NGA where he was not able to find non-ion weapons, so he had to do an ion build plus uh, drones. Yeah, he and then he made it to the flagship and lost. He had this crew death. He had this event in like I think it was NG or no. Maybe it was Mantis Sector 6 or something where he lost like two of two of the starting crew. He didn't find any free crew the whole run. And then uh Yeah, so he 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 went to the flagship with two crew because he was able to buy a slug at the store. Well, there you go, man. There you go. That's That's a free fire beam. Alright. Yeah, oh yeah, no no I thought Oh yeah, he got he got it for free. I, okay, I thought that's what I said, but I guess not. Um, yeah, yeah, so anyways, yeah, it was a bummer, it was a bummer. Right into their trap, oh no. Probably crew kill this. I start a fire and weapons. No more Vulcan. Yeah, guys, that's the best weapon in the game. Oops. 
Ghostly Cloak. They're super dead. Super dead. Super dead. They're super dead. That rebel's dead. That rebel's dead. That rebel's dead. Who? Let's go. Weston. Sorry, guys. I'm being kind of like insane today. Nah, I'm not sorry. Fuck you. <laughs> Yo, Matt. What's up, dude? Welcome back to the channel. How have you been lately? Alright, we get one more jump here. Uh, probably just hacking. Hacking three. What up, just buy power? Sure, dude. I will gladly escort you. Sure. Alright. Should have upgraded sensors. NG Sector 7, let's go. Matt, today we are finishing a run we started last time. Uh, on the Fed B, this is run 49 of the streak. Nice, dude. Free AP drum. Huge. Alright, let's, let's take one more jump into the store. Come on, man. No way. Uh, this fight is like almost safe, but it's not quite, I don't think. Yeah, no. Uh, actually, we have the Breach Bomb. Nah, do I do I care about making this safe though? I mean... They have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So this would go off, or, or, or this would go off? <coughs> the free AP drone confirmed. I think once we found Cloaking, we won, but... The AP drone was a nice, like, high five. Shield could be trained, that's true. Yeah, that's true. Train this Mantis on stuff. I think it's probably okay. I'm not gonna worry about training. I just don't, I don't, I don't think it's a big deal right now. Oh, yeah, oh, just dodge. Seven out of eight shots, yeah, sure. They have a, uh, <laughs> what is that, like a 85, 88% dodge evasion chance right there. That's epic. Good job, guys. Hope you're proud. They have hell evasion, true. Nah, I know you met Ratman. I troll you. al Lisan al guide. what does that mean? talk like I'm from SoCal. Like, oh my god. What are you asking me, Ratman? <laughs> like, oh my god, my favorite movie is um, Lady Bird, directed by Greta Gerwig. Like, it literally reminds me of my mom so much. <laughs> That's Central Cal. Okay, come on. Come on, Ratman, work with me here. Talking to me like a hard gangbanger out of Compton? No, dude. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not... I'm not gonna, like... <laughs> I'm white, dude. That's not <laughs> that's not my impression to do. <laughs> Already so sleepy. Sorry, Maya. Well, I'm not sorry, but heal out. Help. Wake up! Wake up! They're white gangbangers too. Okay, that's true. Maya, you have an objective for me. Assuming all gangbangers out of Compton are black. Okay, well, you got me there. No, that's not what I was assuming. That's... Okay, you guys want to talk about gangbangers from Compton? Did I tell you the story about the Steely Dan concert? Let me tell you that story, okay? A little bit? I think maybe I did tell that story. It's my most hated class in the game. What, my hated ship class? Okay, anyways, the Steely Dan story. So, you guys fuck with Steely Dan? I love Steely Dan. Um. <laughs> okay, game. Okay, okay, okay. So, anyways, the Steely Dan story. Dying on the wheel. Yeah, that's banger. Quad flak, dude, we could go quad flak. 
We need Black Hell. Dude. That would just be for the memes, though. Oh, and Battery Charger. Flackening. I feel like I gotta go Flackening here. Can afford the memes. Winning anyway? Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are. I mean, I yeah, I, I gotta go flattening, dude. I mean, yeah, we are we are winning anyways. So, all right, get out of here, dual lasers. Okay, so the issue now is how do we power this? But it's okay. We can we can sell Zoltan shield to get on second the third flak. And actually, okay, for now, I'm going to keep the, the breach in there. But, um... Well, hold on, we have hacking and cloaking. Uh, I'm, I'm going to keep the, the breach on for now until we get to weapons 8. Do I sell the Zoltan shield? I'm thinking about selling the Zoltan shield. Because it feels like more of a hindrance anyways during the flagship fight. Although, it, eh, it does. Shouldn't have sold dual lasers. Yeah, probably not. It's 12 scrap. That was probably a misplay. It's fine though. Um, what are we in? NG? Okay. Maybe we'll get punished. Do we need to sell Zone Shield? Uh, I mean. Probably not, right? Nah. I, we'll, we'll get we'll get the fl we'll get a third flak on within the next fight, so. Okay, that was probably that was probably a bad play, but it's okay. Whatever, it's fine. Another story. All right, I'll tell the Steely Dan story in a second. Maybe I shouldn't have taken that. I don't know. Okay, wow, just all of the fucking emptiest jumps in the sector. Oh, and actually this connects here. Okay, great. That looks like a two. Let's go, let's go. Didn't even have to fight anyone. So you don't want to go to sleep this one, sure you do not? Yeah, I used to take, um... Hella cold baths, like ice baths. I was I was so in Whoa my god. Someone should make that into an emote. I should make that into an emote, that face that I just made. Double missile all the way, guys. Double missile. Okay. The uh the Steely Dan story. These guys are mega missile true. The Steely Dan story. So I am, I am a very big fan of the of Steely Dan, the uh, the '70s jazz rock uh, outfit, fronted by Donald. F well, it, consisting of Donald Fagan and Walter Becker. Uh, after like you know the, after their first album, they 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 were originally a band, but then they split up. Anyways, big fan of those guys. That is epic. Yeah. Um, and anyways, I got into them in like 2020 and uh, whoa, okay, free, free chain laser. That's cool. I'm not gonna use it because that weapon sucks, but okay, cool. Another store. I'm going to the store, dude. I don't care if it's a dive. I just want to see. <laughs> Do I buy an NG? Pilot NG? I don't know. Nah. I just want to get my weapons up. Is it a dead end? I know. I just wanted to see it. Um, game really wants me to make a good decision. Oh, and I can sell this. Uh, sell chain laser. Yeah, yeah. For sure. Sorry, guys. I keep getting distracted by the, uh, by the, by the game, but, um, anyways, anyways. Okay, so, yeah, got into them summer of, uh, yeah, was it 2020, and then, when was it? Yeah, it would have been 2021, so, no, it was 2022. Uh, 
I was into them for like two years, okay? They were like one of my favorite bands in the world. Uh, edging you with a Cecilia Dan story, yeah. They were one, they, they, and they still are one of my favorite bands. I have like the t-shirt and stuff. Um, but, uh, oh, sure. Yeah, that's awesome. All right. Why am I not happy about this? Uh, so I was, I was hanging out with my, uh, I have this best, one of my best friends lives in, uh, Kansas City. And I was hanging out with him, like, I don't know, just at some point, kind of halfway through my, my junior year in college. Oh, and I didn't even quote ASV, I'm being a dumbass, whatever. Uh, and I, uh, I was hanging out with, with, with his family in Kansas City, and I was there for the weekend, and his dad is like, I don't know, he's like this old guy, he's really into music, he has this, like, epic room in the house that's just, like, dedicated to his vinyl collection. Big music guy, oops. Punished, alright, I'm getting out of there. Well, eh, we could have taken that. We're gonna get re repaired anyways. Um, so this guy, so I'm hanging out in the living room of my friend's house. His dad is like in the other, in his office room, which is like next to the living room, sort of scrolling on Facebook or whatever. And he like, you know, I've, I've spoken to this friend of mine about Steely Dan before. And, you know, his dad, I guess, knows, or like maybe I mentioned it to his dad at some point. And his dad is like scrolling on Facebook. He sees this advertisement for a Steely Dan concert. I guess they they like yeah. He saw like an announcement from them that they're going on tour, and he's like, hey, like M, you know, I, I heard you're into Steely Dan, like blah blah blah. And then so anyways, it turns out that the tickets are super affordable, and the the in, important part here is there was so uh, pause that part of the story, but uh, like. As back as like context for this, my sister and I, my closer sister and I, my closer sibling, and I had been planning uh, a trip to LA for my sister to do just like a, a business trip for her, um, and she wanted to take me, you know, just to drive with her and stuff. And we'd we'd been planning on going to to, to LA for uh, for a while at that point, and I, I I already had the dates, you know, we had everything planned out, and. Uh, yeah, anyways, I saw the tour dates of the Steely Dan concert happen to line up exactly with when we would be in LA. So, yeah, and like I said, the tickets were super affordable. So, all this is to say, I was able to, you know, go to the Steely Dan concert, and it was fucking awesome. And, uh, you know, we, we stayed in um, this area. We, we stayed with one of Marin's friends. One of my siblings' friends, sorry. Oh, anyways. We stayed with one of their friends in uh, in a part of LA. Uh, I guess it's like technically not like even LA if, if you're gonna be a stickler or whatever. It's called Simi Valley. Oh, uh, oops, not on doors, punished. Uh, and Simi Valley is like it's it's like maybe an hour, or like for, it's like 45 minutes to an hour of like a drive away from LA. And uh, uh, by metro or like by transit, like. It's, you know, it's longer than that to, like, actually get into L.A. Because why would there be, like, good public transit, of course? But, um... Yeah, anyways, I went on this crazy, like, train ride, like, bus into a bus ride adventure to, like, get to the Hollywood Bowl, which is where I saw them. And it was a sick fucking show. I mean, Steely Dan was so good, I almost cried multiple times. Like, I was just so... I was so enraptured hearing this music live that I had been, like in love with for so long but okay here's the here's the part of the story that that i was remembering from earlier that that ratman brought up with when he mentioned the gangbangers from compton right so um on my right like I, I was sitting way up in the nosebleeds of the of the hollywood bowl okay i was sitting way up in the back it was pretty far away obviously the audio was i mean it was still very loud but um you could still like talk to pe the people sitting to your left and right, you know. And on my right was this group of older ladies, like they, you know, they had gray hairs. They were like older, um, very nice, very kind, you know. But also like they seemed like they were from LA, you know. And uh, at one point, like, okay, so I, I was not dressed for the for the weather. It got it was like 70 in the day, and then it was like down to, um, you know, 40 in the evening. And, uh, yeah, so these old ladies, 
old, well, older lady sitting next to me. They were super nice. They saw at one point that I was like really cold and like I, they offered to like give me a blanket and they gave me like snacks, you know? They gave me like apple slices and fucking chips or whatever. I don't know, it was nice. And they also gave me like a mini blanket. Maybe I should hack weapons. Um, oh, baby. Um, but on my left was this guy named John, okay? John. John is this older black guy. And, you know, he's real nice, real real personable, real real cool, you know, he's, we're talking on the storm, he's telling me about, uh, about his life. He says he's from South Central LA, okay? And he tells me, like, he's like John the Chicken Man, I guess his name is, and like, I, I looked him up, he's, he's like an actual, I don't, I cloaked way too early there. Okay, fuck you, Triple Black, you suck, I hate you. Um, good dodge, I, I love you, Triple Black, I'm sorry. Uh, hold on. Usually, though, it should be fine. Oh, we still have this old shield up. <laughs> Lol. Uh, so, yeah, anyways, John and I are talking. And at one point, he mentions that he was, in fact, a gangbanger. Uh, with the, he was, he was in the, uh, I believe, the Crips. He was, he was, he, was, he, he banged with the Crips. So, <laughs> he just mentions this very casually, you know. I'm like, I was, like, asking him, you know, where are you from, like, all that kind of stuff just making small talk whatever but yeah he's like yeah i used to gangbang with the crips i'm from south central LA, out la and uh you know like it's nothing like it's you know he, he just kind of brings it up very casually and i'm like oh that's cool you know and uh anyways it doesn't really come up that much again but uh okay and then okay this is kind of related to the story but um oh yeah this one gives a low reward unless you crew kill um uh, at one point, this is like one of the stupidest things I think I've actually ever done. Like, this is so stupid. Don't do this at home. But this guy, like, this, this, again, this random guy who told me, you know, yeah, I used to gangbang. Like, he gives me, he offers me a blunt. Multiple blunts, in fact, throughout the duration of the night. And I'm like, you know, we're chatting, we're friendly, whatever, he's a cool guy. And he, he was like in his 60s, you know, he didn't seem like, like a harm, he didn't seem like, he seemed kind of just harmless, you know, he didn't seem like a bad dude or whatever whatever um but yeah he offers me a blunt i took it it was not laced with anything thank god but obviously it could have been that was a very real possibility oh i gotta like go down here that's annoying um but yeah so i smoked this weed from this guy that i'd never met very very stupid um wow these guys have heavy lasers for days um so the, the real, the sort of crux of this story is at one point, this guy, like, okay, so like I mentioned, I was very excited to see Steely Dan live, right? Like, I was so excited. I was freaking out, man. I was fan, I was like fangirling, you know? I was like literally just almost in tears. This is the longest story you've ever heard. Well, I'm sorry, Spicy Lad. Hey, it's worth it. It's a good story. Uh, Mr. Rude. Okay, I'm getting to the good part, okay? I'm getting to the good part. So, like I said, I was fanboying. I was maybe being a little annoying, okay? Like, I'll admit that. I was being a little annoying. I was, like, singing along very lo loudly to the, to the music. I was being very verbal. I was maybe, like... You know, I was kind of being... I was being a little obnoxious, sure. Like, I, I was... I will admit that, okay? But at one point, like, so, and I, I, I tell you, I was, like, there were multiple songs where I was, like, screaming the lyrics, you know, I was, like, yeah, I was just so into it. Anyways, at one point, this guy, like, this guy, like, yells in my ear at one point between songs or whatever. He's, like, he's fucking furious. Spur fury sparked in his eyes, okay? He's, like, damn, I came here to see them, man. I came here to see them, not you. You need to fucking chill. I, you know, st stuff like that. Like, he's, like, screaming in my ear, telling me to shut the fuck up, basically. <laughs> and he's, like, getting up in my face. <laughs> and I was, like, freaking the fuck out. You know, I'm, like, this skinny white kid, you know, who's just, like, sounds like I needed to chill. Okay, fuck you, rap man. <laughs> yeah, but he, like, basically threatened me with violence, okay? Which, that is not cool, so... <laughs> Uh, yeah. Just 
disclaimer, I have never been to a concert. Okay, so yeah, maybe shut up then, Ratman. <laughs> maybe you have no idea what you're talking about. Hey man, I like I said, it was it was it was like one of the best experiences of my life. It was I mean I still think it was one of the coolest experiences of my life. Like I was so hyped to see to see Sealy Dan. I fucking love that band. But I'm just I thought it was funny that I happened to sit next to this guy who was also like who also used to be a gangbanger, you know? Like, I just think that is hilarious. Sorry for being rude. I hope the blunt and the band were good. Thanks, Spicy Lad. You know, maybe I did deliver that story in a roundabout way. Alright, I forgot to put on the, <laughs> the breach ball. Oh, no, I didn't forget. Well, yeah, I had to die, but whatever. What, I come back and now there's four flax? Yeah. Yeah, you were more rude, rat man. Cope. Okay. It's a little rude. Do you even care about, I mean, what do we even hack here? Maybe just missiles or something. I don't know. Evasion. And your toxic arc? Yeah, it's awesome. I wonder how an evasion hack would work. Put auto fire on? Okay, that's true. Oh, triple dodge. Die. Goodbye. But yes. Sorry, I feel like you guys missed the crux of the story. Which is that I got threatened by a former gang member. Uh, maybe we don't need <laughs> auto fire. We got the story? Okay. Well, you guys are mean. You're meanie heads. You're meanie poops. Please die. I hate you. I hate you. I'm going to jump away from the shield hack. And also put on the breach. You still love me. Good to know. <laughs> Shoot 12 shots, hit one of them. That's the auto surveyor promise. Auto surveyor way. Oh my god, dude. They dodged 10. They dodged 10 of my shots. They dodged literally 10 out of 12. That's what is that? Five out of six? That's like 80%. What the fuck is that? One? Come on, man. Quad flak. Best setup in the game. Right? Okay. Well, it's pretty, it's pretty solid. Alright, that's, that's actually really nice. Alright, let's do the breach. I don't even know. What do we get? Uh, piloting. Power. Maybe flak hell wasn't the best idea. Yeah, probably not, but it, it's fun. It's funny. And I like it, so I think it's good. Alright, here we go. For real this time. For real, for real, for real this time. For real, for real. Alright. Memeing on Streak Run 49. It's not memeing. I mean, it's, it's, it's an incredibly good setup. What do you bet this gets us killed? It's not going to get us killed, right, man. I don't, I don't see how that would be possible. It, it maybe like is slightly less optimal than something else we're gonna, we could have done, but we have hacking and cloaking. Not rebel five, my, my push for flak hell. Okay, I don't think it was, I don't think it was low IQ. I think it was a fine. I mean, I think it's fine. Have you seen how we have been? I mean, have you seen how quickly we kill ships? I'm gonna do that. 
this. Shit, this blackening. True. Hype as hell, yeah, dude. I agree. Nice. Okay, cloaking. That's not so bad. Would have preferred art artillery. Don't miss. Good job. Cloak. Yeah, breach bomb is so fucking good, dude. Fire bomb cannot do that. Fire, fire. Oh, sorry, fire beam. Fire beam is not even guaranteed to actually like do anything to to a room that you're targeting. Let me get this guy. You're fucked. Get him. Eh. I'm going to snooze the ad break that Twitch wants me to take. The dodge is huge. F Come on, man. What the hell? Mr. Boonga. Come on, yeah, nice. Get this guy. Huge. I didn't really have to get that guy, but it felt good. What do you guys think the lore implications are of the character known as Mr. Booga? Thank you, Flack 2. Flack 1. Of Mr. Booga, yes. What's his deal, man? You do be boogieing. Lots of boogers. <laughs> That's fine. Nice. You do be boogieing. Do you do you think his favorite snack snack is bugles? Do you think he his favorite whale is a beluga? Do you think his favorite? <laughs> I don't even know. I don't know. I think his favorite enemy in a Mario game is a Boonga, Boonga, I don't know. I'm trying guys, I'm trying. Maybe we can snipe, uh... no, they're out, they're out, no. I was gonna say maybe we can snipe Med Bay, but no. It's fucked up. No, no kill. We still have 32 bombs, let's fucking go. His favorite instrument is the Wa Wagner Buga tuba. Come on, man, you fucker. You fucker ducka. How do I kill thee? Let me count the ways. Something, something. I don't even remember the rest. Fuck you up the butt, man. He puts on his booga booga shoes and goes with you. I wanna boo with you. And we can ride the boogie. Should that be the love? I'm gonna boog with you all night. Boog into the sunlight. My cat is being a demon again. The 
Booga don't start till I walk in. Don't stop, make it pop. We can booga on top. Tonight I'm a boog till the see the sunlight. Come on, man. What the fuck? It's really hard to like do this when I when I don't have anything supporting my breach. I feel like that's the kicker here. Yoshi, stop. Hold on. so annoying I don't whatever uh, it just takes time I guess see if I do that then they have two people repair it I don't get it down in time oh did I get that no Come on, then. Work with me. Where do I snipe this guy? Smedda? No. Fuck me. Come on. Oh my god, this is really annoying. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I think it's just because I don't, I literally have no support damage for my flak that I can aim. And then he's gonna cloak this. anymore i don't know what's going on but you get flack yeah all right just kill these assholes I don't even care. okay thank you got that final breach just says a fuck you okay you know twitch is begging me to take an ad break so i'm gonna do that i also have to pee kind of bad now and uh i have to uh check on my cats uh so i will be right back we're gonna take on phase two of the flagship you know what i'll just i'll wait I'll wait just to uh, just to get the get the get the tension pumping here. Okay, wait, yeah, do this. Okay, all right, all right. We're gonna be fine anyway. True. Okay, I will see you guys in three minutes. Be right back. Accessing an area where where she was not meant to access. So sorry about that, and uh, thanks for your patience there. Okay, all right, we're gonna follow them for phase three. See who gets mind controlled. Honestly, any of them would be kind of annoying, but you should be able to deal with it. Hunting unwooly wabbits. Oh, we have Zoltan Shield. Ha! Okay, well, I'm smart. I am very intelligent. And also good at this game. Oh, and they have three crew. <laughs> Okay, so we are gonna resist. Nice, okay, we will, we will, we are guaranteed to, oh my gosh, oh gosh, hold on, hold on, sorry. She's like being a demon, man. Kitty, you can't go up there. She's like trying to go in the closet. 
She's like trying to jump up onto the shelf in the closet, but it's like it's like slatted. So her little kitty paws can't <laughs> maneuver. Okay, is it how late is it? Insane dodges. Okay, they're gonna mind control me. I guess I should have prepared for this. I could cloak now to uh, avoid getting mind controlled and then like hack missiles even. Yeah, maybe I'll just do that. I'll just do that, that's fine. Get him, get him. Oh, come on. They got through anyways, it's fine. You're bored. Oh, get on doors, you dumb fuck. That was calculated. Super calculated. Alright, easy game. Good game. Yay! 49 runs, baby. That is, uh, 7 squared times in a row that we've won the game man feels good hello lacy is home let's go hype epic, epic black hell loadout true yeah we there was no shot we lost that rat man i can't believe you even said that at one point 5367 um i feel like that's probably accurate like low low five thousands for sure yeah 52 okay 43 Right on. Hell yeah. Here's our stats. We uh, we started the run halfway through. We started today at the start of Sector 4. So these are a little outdated. Being way melodramatic, of course, of course. Classic. Classic. Um, cool. Okay. Uh, uh, I got distracted, sorry. Um... All right, let's do uh, let's do the fifty here. Oops, sorry about that. Um, cool. Yeah, that was a pretty good run. That was pretty good. Whoa, what the fuck? You guys see that? The hell was that? Whoa, what the fuck? Missing no. Is my shit broken? No, it's fine. The squirrels, dude. True. It's the squirrels. Nah, it's just because of my monitor weirdness. Alright. Yeah, it's your fault, Ratman. How did you know? Bum, bum, bum. Dunk, dunk, dunk. Alright. March 19th. Uh, how long did this run take? I don't know. I think we were doing it for like an hour last night. Or no, Sunday night. And then this was like, what, two hours? So, yeah. Let's call it like three three hours. Yeah. 49. That'd be. Okay, how much scrap was that? 1610. Not bad, not bad. Uh, 239 free stuff. Including uh, two... No, wait, we bought a flak and then we found a flak. Okay. We bought three flaks that run, actually. All right, final score was what? 52, 20, 52, 20, yeah. 43 ships, 101 beacons, and uh, I believe two damage taken on the flagship there. Flak times four, epic. Starting plus Mantis human. Act float. Uh, yes. Nice. Okay. That was a swell fed B run. And uh, we are going to do one more here. Beautiful. All right. We are going to do another run. We're at 151. Should have gone outside. You're awake. Hello. Maya, you got to commit to being awake. Gotta drink some coffee or drink a Red Bull or something. Monster. 
<clears throat> that is officially 49 wins in a row. Now we have done two out of th the three fed ships, which were two of the two of the scarier ones that are left. That, or you know, all of the fed ships are kind of scary. And uh, that is 61 runs tracked. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay. All right, all right. We are we are ready to to get rolling here. We're just gonna go straight into run two. Um, let me update the stream title. As a matter of fact. All right, um, so, and let's look here, actually. Let's look at the, uh, hold on one sec. All right, we are back. Sorry again for that uh, interruption there. Uh, we were going to update the ship's remaining graphic that I have here, so let's do that. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, it is, it is March 19th. We have done 49 runs. We have seven ships remaining. And that was the Federation B, so. Is that for ya? Okay. So yeah, so uh, remaining are Mantis A and C, Roxy, Zoltan C, Fed C, and Kestrel B and NGB. So yeah, some good ones, some bad ones, some mid ones. But uh, let's uh, let's random our next ship and see what we get. Did I? Yeah, I think I did. Okay. 